good morning and um so today's monday and i'm headed out the door i'm about to go grocery shopping we need a little bit of everything when i say everything everything we need ketchup mayonnaise i need another bottle of mustard the honey needs some italian dressing um we'll have no meat there's like four little chicken nuggets and a bag like a third of a bag of some frozen fish patties in a freezer um oh there's some sausage links in the refrigerator so yeah that sums it up for the meat um i need to get some rice i just need to go grocery shopping okay last week i didn't get much because um, we already had some food left over from the week prior to that so the last trip i went on was strictly for what olivia wanted to eat for dinner for her birthday and that's all i got um but this time <laughs> i need to fill my pantries up uh it's gonna be getting cold soon the weather is already kind of changing a little bit it's a little bit cooler now outside in the mornings so the weather is gonna be changing so sorry y'all that just felt like a lot of work putting on my socks but the weather is going to be changing soon and um so i need to stock up my pantries okay i need to stock up my pantries so that i'm not running to the store when it starts to get really cold i'm not running to the store two three times a week getting stuff okay um so my plan is i have some coupons that i want to use and make sure So, me. Oh. Sorry. So, I have some coupons that I want to use. I did make a list. How true am I going to stay to this list? I don't know. It just depends on what's on sale. Here's what I've been doing, okay? Or here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go based off of what's on sale. Because I've tried to do the once in a month thing. I've tried, like I said, I've tried to do all my stuff and it just don't work out. So, depending on what's on sale, that's what's going to be for dinner. So, let me flip you guys around and kind of give you an idea of my list. Um, and hopefully, we'll go buy it. <laughs> so, this is where we're going. I figure I would have something that could kind of keep me on track while I'm at the store instead of just going with no list. Uh, we're going to try it again, y'all. So, anyway, so this is going to be for the week of the 7th through the 14th. So, today is the 7th. Um, so, these are the meals that I'm thinking about. Um, some baked pasta with the red sauce, some salmon if it's on sale with the yellow rice or some type of rice and broccoli, um, baked chicken. I've got these uh, McCormick, is it McCormick? No, it's Kingsford seasonings that um, I picked up from the Dollar Tree. If you guys follow me on Instagram, then you saw me post those photos. And so I've got uh, lemon pepper, Cajun, and another kind. So for one of the baked chickens, y'all see I have it on here twice. For one of the baked chickens, I'm going to use one of those seasonings. And for the other baked chicken, I'm not sure if it's going to be maybe barbecue baked chicken or if it's just going to be plain baked chicken. But the sides are going to be mashed potatoes and green beans. And on the other uh, dish for baked chicken will be collard greens and macaroni and cheese. And then Hamburger Helper will be for one of those nights. Hamburger Helper is on sale for 99 cents right now. And I do have two Kroger digital coupons that I plan on using for that. Um, so, yeah. So, here's the list. So, we need the salmon, elbow noodles, pasta sauce, ground turkey, chicken legs. Now, they sell bags of chicken legs for $5. So, I plan on getting two of those. One for uh, one of the baked chicken meals. And then I plan on getting a bag of chicken breast for the other baked chicken meal. Um, I plan on getting eight boxes of Hamburger Helper only because I have coupons. I have two Kroger digital coupons that are $2 off when you buy four. Um, so I want to go ahead and utilize those. Um, I want to stock up my pantry with canned veggies. Um, some collard greens, potatoes, green peppers, onions. This time I'm going to get a bag of onions and onion powder. Um, and I need some freezer bags. And I need some coffee. I don't have any more coffee and I really want some right now, y'all. I need some cooking oil, cheese. Cheese is on sale for 99 cents. I need more eggs, need more butter. Pancake mix, I think, is on the 99 cent mix and match sale as well. I have a coupon for that. And rice aroni boxes, I have coupons for. So these are all of the coupons that I'm going to attempt to use today. I'm going to 
do the coup these set of coupons first that's my strategy i'm gonna go in the store get what i absolutely need first and then go back through the store and get what we could possibly use that's on sale so i will see y'all at the store I'm back from the store <laughs> look at all this stuff now i try to go by the list y'all for the most part i did go by the list i got a lot of things on the list and then i got a few extra um so i wasn't able to use all of the coupons that i had intended to use today which is okay because um sometimes the better deal is not always when you use the coupon sometimes the better deal is on the store brand or um a different brand so if normally how I do it is if I have a coupon for something and it's on sale but for cheaper than the store brand then I go ahead and get it if I can get the store brand cheaper the exact same product then I just go with that so I'm gonna try to remember how much all this stuff was somewhere throughout the video I'll put how much I spent and how much I saved because I did have to do three transactions um so we'll get into all that here in a second okay so like i was saying i did have to do three transactions um the second transaction or the last transaction was this water i didn't get it the first transaction so or the second transaction so this was the third transaction so the water is 349 so i got two cases of that 32 count um so here we go we're gonna go from left to right and i even have some stuff there in the kitchen so i'm um, right now i'm just gonna go through everything in the coupons and try to remember what the prices were i will put somewhere throughout the video how much i actually paid in full including any coupons um any savings that i had minus coupons and i bought a rebate Okay, so I need to put this stuff up. It took a while for me to get it in and get it out to show you guys. So I'm just going to breeze through this real quick. So we already went through the water. Um, so I picked up this pizza. I had a Kroger coupon where you got $5 off. I'm lying. $3 off when you spend $15 on out of the frozen department. Now, that coupon excluded seafood, um... It excluded a whole bunch of stuff basically um, so what I could get was some vegetables in this pizza and some waffles so I got this pizza which was five dollars there's four in the pack I picked up the combination um, this was just to get over that $15 hump to use the coupon so I just picked this up these were a dollar 49 and they're blueberry waffles um, which Olivia loves blueberry so just got that for her um, picked up some diced tomatoes. These were I got two of them So the other one is somewhere here on the table, but I picked up diced tomatoes. They were two for a dollar needed some mayo um, This was two forty nine and I picked picked up about eight boxes of these rice aronis They were ten for ten and I had a dollar off when you buy four so I've somewhere on the table I've got a total of eight boxes um had a coupon for 40 cents off it was a kroger coupon that you get in the mail these were 159 so i picked that up i needed some creamer these are two for five i didn't have a coupon for that um i did have coupons for hamburger helper um so the hamburger helper is 99 cents um when you mix and match by five so i had two digital kroger coupons that were two dollars off when you buy four so i bought eight of those got some vegetable oil we needed some ketchup so these were 10 for 10 so I got two of those the other one is somewhere here on the table got a thing of panty liners these were $3.99 um, so got that I normally coupon for that but uh, I haven't I'm gonna do a whole separate uh, trip for personal care items later on in the year so got this this is the kobe jack cheese eight ounce so these are 188 so i got a mixture of block cheese and shredded cheese got some bu some butter this was on clearance for 30 cents so i picked it up um this is beef flavored broth so i actually got two of those 
Um, they were the only two on the shelf. Needed some onion powder, so pick that up. Pasta sauce is one of those situations where I had a coupon for a Borelli pasta sauce, but the um, it was priced for $1.99 on sale, but when I saw these, these are a dollar. And since I season all of my food anyways, like we don't, we never just eat straight pasta sauce out of the jar. I always season it up. So it doesn't really matter the brand because I'm going to throw a bunch of seasoning in it anyways. Um, so let's move around. Okay, so I had a coupon for a free bag of chips. It was a Kroger coupon that comes in the mail. Got some bananas. These were 59 cents a pound, so I just got one bunch of those. Uh, this Sprite is not part of the haul there. I actually brought that from home and took it with me to drink while I was in the store. Um, got a thing of eggs. Eggs are now back at regular price, so they were $1.19. Um, last week, they were 88 cents. I had a coupon, a Kroger coupon that comes in the mail for 70 cents off of one pound of ground turkey. So I did pick that up and I picked up another three pound of ground turkey. These are $8.99 normally and this was not on the list, but I did pick it up anyways because it was on sale for, well, it's marked down for $5.17 and it's just a boneless pork loin. And, okay, so let's go back over here. <laughs> There's so much stuff, y'all. Um, so I've got some canned goods. So I picked up two of the cut green beans and then two of the corns. Um, it made more sense to get these because these were $2.19 and one can was $0.65. Cents. So I uh, got that. Got a bag of yellow onions. This was part of me getting that, uh, using that coupon for the save three when you spend 15 So... I think this was five or six dollars. I don't know, y'all. But uh, this was part of that. So I just picked that up. Corn on a cob. Got a big bag of long grain rice. I really wanted to get jasmine rice, y'all. I had jasmine rice for the first time last month. And oh, why didn't y'all tell me that it smells so good? I didn't realize excuse me I didn't realize that rice actually had a fragrance so jasmine rice smells really good y'all mm, I know side note but um I found this serve and savor big bag of rice five pounds and it was only $2.69 same with this big bag of pinto beans so I got that $2.69 got this bag of cauliflower blend so this is the big bag and I think this is six bucks Got a thing of potatoes. They were on sale for $3.99. Got a bag of the shredded collard greens. These are normally either $3.99 or $4.99. One of those. Then we come on over around here. The Sara Lee bread was $0.99. Cents, so I got two of those. And so was the um, french fries. So I've got two of these bags. Now, I did a mixture of promotions here. I did the $0.99 cent Oh, no, I just did the one promotion. Yeah, the $0.99 cent, um, when you buy five mix and match. So I got two of these, actually. Uh, the other one's over there. And here is the Barilla Pasta. Now, I did have a coupon for this, but I also had one on my Kroger card. It was a dollar off when you buy four, and these are 10 for 10 right now. Um, and the coupon that I have expires on November 3rd, so... I might go back and get four more boxes of these pastas since that's one thing that I wanted to stack up on. So I did get three elbow noodles and one spaghetti. Here's the fourth spaghetti. And then I got this spaghetti because I had a 20 cents off digital coupon for that. Um, got some freezer bags, which were 99 cents. Got a bag of chicken legs. I said I was going to get two, but I only got the one because I ended up getting the pork roast. So these are $5. I got a bag of plums. These were on sale for $4.99 or $3.99, one of those. Um, but Olivia really likes plums, so I got her that. Got some Parmesan cheese. Got some zesty Italian dressing. This is part of the mix and match by five, four ninety-nine cents. So I got that. And here is the rest of the rice aronis and hamburger helpers. So I got two of the beef pastas. There's the other one. I got two of the Southwest pastas, two of the four cheese lasagnas, 
and two of the beef stroganoff so there's one over there and the other one is over here somewhere probably under that cheese um so the rice aroni i did get eight of those so i got two cheddar broccolis two of the stir fried rice two of the mexican style and two of the chicken so i had two coupons now i've been getting my inserts i haven't been buying newspapers i actually been getting my inserts from the mailbox area in our apartment complex a lot of people you know they talk they get their mail but then they toss what we like to call junk mail and a lot of times that's where the inserts are located so i get inserts in the mail and then if i see a few hanging around outside the mailbox i grab those too so that's how i ended up with two coupons for the rice aroni okay and where are we oh got a thing of coffee got a thing of chicken breast i think these were 6.99 um i'm gonna put these in the oven with probably oh i didn't get no gravy that's okay i probably have to make my own but anyway so yeah probably put these in the oven with mac and cheese or use one of the kingsford seasonings one of those had a 70 cents off of uh, one of these so these were 249 or something like that 179 y'all don't get me to line I don't even remember how much that was but I know for sure I had a 70 cent off coupon then the cheese was part of the mix and match by five for 99 cents so uh, I got two because I had a coupon for 40 cents off of one of them and then so I just picked up the other one since it was 99 cents uh, got some smoked neck bones for green beans, collard greens, that type of stuff. Got some breakfast sausage. This isn't exactly the one that I was looking for. I was actually looking for the box that has like 18 of them. The Kroger brand, but they didn't have any. They had the other boxes, but I wasn't trying to pay like 8 9 $10 for a box of sausage. You know what I'm saying? Which I probably should have because this was two for five. Now that I'm saying it out loud, it makes more sense that I probably should have went on ahead and got the other one. Because, let's see, this is 16 sausages for $5. Oh, well, no, I saved a little bit of money because two more pieces of sausages, I would have been paying 8 bucks. But anyway, so these are two for 5 So I got these for breakfast for one morning on the weekend. Um, that's why I got two of these tater rounds, too. One morning over the weekend for breakfast or whatnot um and some pork chops now let's go over here because i got a little bit more stuff okay so these pepperonis were 10 for 10 um i got these mushrooms they were marked down to 99 cents so i went ahead and got that here is some more cheese so for the cheeses the other block was colby jack that's sharp this is Monterey Jack, um, got some Parmesan cheese, which normally is more than all the other cheeses, but it was $1.88 as well, so took advantage of that. Got some mozzarella, some Italian blend, and some more sharp. And then here goes the cans of corn, and I got some fish. So the fish was $5.99. This is Pacific Whiting. Um, so that is it for you guys thank you guys for tuning into my channel comment like and subscribe if you have not subscribed already make sure you hit that thumbs up if you like this video join the family and i will see y'all on the next one bye Fingers.